you like to wire the electronic compact starter, then continue watching. Hi, I am Mareike from ABB Control Products. In this video, I'll show you how to wire our new electronic compact starter, named HF Range. Due to the internal locking circuit and the load wiring, the amount of cabling required is reduced to a minimum. This, of course, leads to minimized risk of wiring faults. All in all, the compact starter gives you up to 75% reduced wiring time, leading to reduced maintenance costs. If you would like to learn more about the HF range itself, please find one of the video links below. Now, let's have a look at the terminals. All settings and adjustments are made directly at the HF range. All 13 HF range devices are structured the same way. Motor control terminals can be found on the top side of each device, whereas the three-phase power supply for the motor is realized on the bottom. Terminals T1, T2 and T3 are the output voltage terminals. They have to be connected with the motor. Terminals L1, L2 and L3 are the input voltage terminals. They have to be connected with the three-phase supply network. Please also establish device and wire protection here. Terminal U small s supplies the HF range with 24V DC. It has to be connected with a 24V DC power supply. Its reference potential is the terminal right next to it. Depending on the HF range type, there is one or two control input terminals. For direct online starters, there is one control input terminal labeled with ON. It has to be connected with a switch and a 24V DC power supply that we just connected. For reversing starters, there are two control input terminals. The R terminal is for forward operation and the L terminal is for the reversing mode. They have to be connected with switches and the 24V DC power supply as well. After the overload function has tripped, the HF range can be reset automatically or manually. For manual reset, connect a push button with a normally open contact between the MAN and the RES terminals. For automatic reset, establish an electrical connection between the RES and AUT terminals. In HF range types with integrated emergency stop, you'll find this terminal, which is the reference potential for the control input. The signal relay is activated as soon as the electronic compact starter detects an error or indicates a message. The normally open contact between terminals 96 and 97 is closed and the normally closed contact between terminals 95 and 96 is opened. The LEDs have various functions, like indicating the set nominal current, displaying the status for diagnostics and showing the operation status. You have just become an expert for wiring our new HF range. Thank you for listening and see you in the next video.